Welcome back. Our pal, Detective Mosley, has been murdered. This time they really went too far. It's personal now. We must find this Tetlow character and beat her the hell out of Malia and get revenge for Mosley's uh, murder. All that's left of Mosley was his wallet, which we located. It's a man's wallet. Let's take a look inside. Maybe there's some clues. Gabriel opens the wallet and finds some ID belonging to Mosley and an American's repressed card. Americans repressed? Mosley's American's repressed card. Credit. <laughs> what a concept. I guess they weren't allowed to use the name American Express. But we got Mosley's credit card. Let's go order stuff online. Wait, it's 1993. The internet hasn't been invented yet. Well, technically it has, but... Uh, I mean, the internet is from the 70s. But uh, it's not in common use yet. Definitely not for e-commerce. I guess whoever was in there and knocked us out and everything also left the plaque open. But with uh, Mosley dead and um, no sign of Tetelo or the talisman here, I think it might be a good idea to seriously um, consider seeking safe harbor in Germany. Where have you been? I was worried about you. For good reason, apparently. What happened? D do you need a doctor? Nothing you want to know about, and no, just some aspirin. Gabriel, this is nuts. You have to get out of New Orleans. No kidding. Well, listen. Wolfgang called while you were out. He said, and I quote, Tell Gabriel that I found what I was looking for. It's time for me to do my duty. Schloss Ritter is his now. Now, call me crazy, but I don't think that's good news. Not for Uncle Wolfie, no. What are you going to do? If I figure it out, I'll let you know. Wait, that sounds like Wolfgang has decided to go after the tribe on his own. Exactly what he told us not to do. Way to practice what you preach, uh, Wolfgang. Besides, isn't the guy like 80? Uh, or, I don't know, 60. Old, in any case. However, um, we want to go to Germany to follow up on that. Figure out what uh, Uncle Wolfgang found out and what he is up to. And to get out of New Orleans, because it really is getting a little hot under our feet here. What with Mosley, uh, you know, murdered. Tends to uh, fall under the bad things category. Now, in order to get away from uh, this place, recall the um, white page that we got from uh, Grace earlier. It conveniently lists the number for a travel agency. See the world. I see what you did there. 585-1130. And, well, since we're broke, I guess we're going to have to make use of Mosley's credit card to um, pay for that. Well, it's not like Mosley's going to need it anymore, is he? Good thing he told us his maiden name at the beginning of the game. Actually, you don't need the maiden name at all. I wonder if there was originally going to be a puzzle with that, where you would need it in order to uh, use his credit card or something. But um, there isn't. You've already got. You've over. You've over.
You've over. You've over. I'm trying to pick up the phone. Hello. See the World Travel Agency. How may I help you? Uh, let's ask for the specials just for fun. What are your specials? Two weeks in India for 2,000 rupees. Well, that's certainly special. Uh-huh. Is there something else I can help you with? 2,000 rupees. I have no idea how much that is. Trip to the Car Caribbean. Yeah, let's just forget about all this voodoo business and go party. How much for a trip to the Caribbean? Well, our least expensive trip is four days, three nights in St. Croix for $1,250. Of course, we have much nicer packages available. I'm sure your packages are astonishing, but that's out of my league. Is there something else I can help you with? Okay, well, that, that line of questioning isn't going anywhere. Let's uh, ask him about Rittersburg, Germany. How much for a trip to Rittersburg, Germany? Rittersburg, Germany? Hold on, let me look that up. I can fly you into Munich. That's the closest airport to Rittersburg. You can rent a car from there, or take the train. Let's see. The best price I can see for the flight is $1,400. What would you like to do? $1,400? For a flight from the U.S. to Germany? That's ridiculous. Well, I guess it is very short notice. But still, expensive. Charge it to my Americans repressed. Yes, sir. And your name was? Mosley. Feeling a little guilty. Gabriel gives the travel agent Mosley's card number and is informed that he can pick up his ticket at the New Orleans International Airport. Well, you know, there are some airlines still that will let you get away with not using your own credit card to uh, buy tickets. Not many, though. Guess what? I'm going to Germany. Really? That's great, but how on earth could you afford? A man's gotta do what a man's gotta do. Oh my god. I wouldn't like the sound of that even if you were a man. I miss you too, Grace. Okay, uh, time to head out to the airport, I guess. And pay a visit to our old family castle. Schloss Ritter. Goodbye, Gracie. Good luck. Let me know what's going on, will you? Of course. And discover the secrets of the old castle. Wait, that's a Scrooge McDuck story. Written by Karl Barks. New Orleans International Airport. Gabriel picks up his tickets at the airport. And boards are playing for Munich. Indiana Jones style uh, travel map. Appropriate, I suppose. Schloss Ritter, I presume. Looks cold. Is that the woman who answered the phone? Hello. My name is Knight. Gabriel Knight. Herr Knight! Oh, kommen Sie bitte, Herren. I mean, Herein. come in, please, Herr Knight. I was not expecting you. Has Wolfgang sent you here? Uncle Wolfgang? No, I came to see him. Isn't he here? No, he is gone. I'm sorry. You came all this way. Oh, great. That's all I need. Herr Knight, Wolfgang told me all about you and gave me instructions for you to feel welcome here. Please, this is your home. You are a ritter, no? I am just doing some work. I will continue and you may make yourself comfortable. If there is anything you need, please ask me. You may use Wolfgang's bedroom. It is at the top of the stairs. Thank you, Miss... Uh... You may call me Gerda, Herr Knight. 
Gerda, well, nice to meet you. I suppose she's uh, a servant or something here. Maybe she worked here for Uncle Wolfgang. Maybe she's part of uh, uh, Care for the Elderly or something, I don't know. The great hall of Schloss Ritter towers around Gabriel. You can imagine the heating bill. Yeah, keeping a castle like this warm cannot be um, cheap. High up in the wall is a small window. Considering it's June, the, it must be high up in the mountains, I suppose. Otherwise, why would there be snow in Germany in the summer? A few tapestries hang on the wall. Gabriel isn't sure if they mean something. Or if they're just good insulation. Or decoration. There's a dragon's head on the wall. It looks like a real dragon's head, Drew. This Shadow Hunter stuff is serious. So somebody in our family slayed a dragon and then decided to put the head on the wall? Cheerful. There's a dragon shadow. Can we take that? The trophy belongs in that spot. I suppose not. More tapestries. A few tapestries hang on the wall. Give Same message. Anything behind the tapestries? The castle doesn't need rearrangement. The castle doesn't need... Nope. Wrong game for that. A lion's head. Well, that is the symbol of our family, isn't it? It's a lion's head carved in stone. That it is. A large handcraft dagger hangs on the wall. It looks quite old, but it's been polished to a high shine. Can we take that? That weapon might be a bit much to carry round. Now the dagger. This dagger. It is the knife of a Schattenjäger. You may take it, Herr Knight. Everything in this castle is yours now. There's another weapon here, the one that Gabriel was refusing to carry around. A few ancient weapons are down the hall. Bit hard to tell from this angle. Looks like an axe of some kind. The dagger is uh, much more useful. And we can give it to Cosima. Wait, wrong game. The Ritter dagger is solid. Weighty. And highly polished. And of course, there is um, Gertie herself. Gertie is young and quite attractive. And what's she doing? Potatoes. They must grow well around here. She is peeling potatoes, quite a lot of them. Either she's very hungry, or she's expecting a large amount of people. I don't know. Well, we'll see if we can talk to Gerdi and uh, learn anything from her in the next video.